You know, sometimes the people don't want to file the case because they are afraid. You see, we don't know. Maybe there is a threat because uh, because it, what happened to those two kids also? It is a kind of revenge because that mother had filed, had gone to the police station to report about his, uh, what he had done to her. To her. So, one reason may be like that, because they are afraid. Another reason may be, uh, let us say, many reasons are there for the people not to file FIR. But in the case of domestic violence, there is another alternative. The, the women won't file this uh, FIR, but the police can file this uh, DIR. Domestic. What is it? Forward the case to the protection. Uh, yeah, you, you ask uh, Kong, uh, he will know better about that. Okay, you explain about that, uh, Kong. No, the other alternate option the police could have done was to actually, because it's a duty of the police under the Domestic Violence Act, the police could have referred the case immediately to the one-stop center, the protection officer, center manager is the protection officer, she, they could have immediately referred the case to OSC for immediate intervention, so that um, anything could have been prevented. So you recommend that all the cases should be? Uh, in this similar way, it has to be done. All domestic violence yeah, cases. Yeah, all domestic violence. Because there, the act is actually to, work, to provide immediate relief to the woman, even though she's not willing to file an FIR. A domestic incident report is a, and a DV act is a civil law, so she immediately get relief, no, under the act. So they also take necessary action according to what she gives her story. So have you recommended any action against the police to punish some? under some section, so that they won't repeat. Uh, from the Women Commission, we will put our points of uh, recommendations to the, to the Home Minister, and we will send a copy also to the DGP office, and then we will insist, as I said before, that this kind of uh, the tactic habits of the police should not happen again. They should be sensitive to the plight of the women.